Hello friends, welcome in Ankita's Tech Tutorial. In today's class, we will learn dinosaur game in Scratch. See, my dinosaur is jumping with the space bar, it can jump, and the cactus is continuously moving on the screen from right to left. So, how to create this game that we will learn? So, subscribe my channel and start writing code with me. Here, I have a nice background, and there are two sprites. This is one dinosaur and this is one cactus. So now we will start writing code. Here I am going to select sprite 1 that is dino. Change the name of sprite. Select this one and change y by 10. Then it will move up. This process will be required again and again. Repeat 10. Now we have to take this dino down also. So for that motion and change y by minus 10 control repeat and these all things we will take with when space key pressed first place this dinosaur down and start working it's working so what we did to jump dinosaur we have to take change y by 10 and change y by minus 10 you can change their number on the place of 10 I am writing here now 20 and here minus 20 now again see nice it's jumping high so this is our first step done now in the next step we will move our cactus from right to left so select this second sprite cactus and go to x y see when my cactus is on the right side that time x value is 219 minus 148 so right side x axis is a plus value and left side x is minus value so we have to move our cactus from right to left so for that go to x and y here I am writing 240. See now cactus place is here. Then glide one second minus 240. Minus 240 means leftmost corner. So here we will write minus 240 minus 156. Now just check it. Yes, it's done. Now event when flag clicked and see my cactus is moving here now we have to do this action forever so go to control and forever now check it yes we have done two steps our dinosaur is jumping on the screen and cactus is moving from right to left when this dinosaur is touching to cactus we have to stop the game so for that we will write next code click on cactus and select here stop all from control category then from sensing touching dino and wait until wait until touching dino event when flag so with this code it will stop when our cactus is touched to the dinosaur it will stop all and we have to write some code for dinosaur also it will start from original place so now here I have to take go to go to x174 y 123 event when clicked now we will check our game on the big screen start playing when it touched to dinosaur it will stop all Yeah, it's working nicely. To make this game more interesting, we will make duplicate of this cactus. Then there will be more hurdles on the place of dinosaur. So now I have two cactus. And for the second cactus, here the duplicate of first one. That's why whole code is also duplicate. We have two cactus, but we can't see that two together. Because 
that placed on the same place so what we have to do here we have to make it separately we will do some change in the second character code that wait a second control wait a second and first it will hide and after one second show then now we can see these both characters separately just try it here very good it's working nicely now the last step is we will add the score so click on dinosaur and make a variable go to variable make a variable name of variable is score change score by 1 we have to place it at the end and set score 0 it will start from the zero okay just try it yes my score is changing and now my game stop i will start again then it is starting from zero yeah on 160 it stop <laughs> that's it so like this we can create dinosaur game in scratch hope you understand this if you like this video then like share and subscribe my channel thank you so much